today. It's Tony Fortunato from the Technology Firm. I'm going to walk you through a neat little exercise where you can uh, start capturing and when you hit stop capture and close Wireshark it would have saved the file automatically. So let me show you how that works. I'm going to work from my Wi-Fi adapter. So I'm going to hit capture options here because that's where we want to work. And you can see there's Wi-Fi. It is selected and there's a capture filter if you wanted to use one I'm not so I'm just gonna come down here and type in capture files a path obviously if you know where it is then you can obviously type whatever you want and there you go and for the people who care we'll we'll do it in an ng whoops typo a pcap ng format so here's the folder where it's going to go it's going to go to e traces and that's exactly what I type. So right now there's currently nothing in there just to kind of show you. I'm going to hit start and of course I've got a, a web page in the background. I can hit refresh and you can see a whole bunch of stuff flying by. I can hit stop and then watch. Just close. Boom. Gone. Now if I come back here and type DIR there it is. Test 1 PCAP NG. So if I just type test one pcap ng there's my trace file simple isn't that cool hope that helped have a good day bye for now